She says she talks to animals, and today she pitched in to help find a pony that had wandered off in Redmond. Come for us, Joel Marino's live at the stable with the pony's 24-hour adventure and the curious way she made it home. Joel? Mary, there had been a massive search effort out here yesterday, but without success. So today, a kind of animal psychic got involved. She took one look at a picture of this pony, and she told search teams where to go. Guided out by rescue teams, Gemma looked pretty good for a pony that had just spent the past day trapped on a ledge down a ravine. I cannot even put it into words right now. I am just so happy. I am so thankful. Property owner Barbara Linstead says Gemma went missing yesterday when she failed to come in from pasture to have her breakfast. Turns out the 800-pound mare broke an outer fence eating grass and wandered off into a ravine. Searchers spent all of Monday looking and today called a horse whisperer for help. I pick up on the pictures, words, and feelings of animals and get a sense of uh, what they're feeling in an experience. Joan Rankett says she used a photograph of Gemma to channel the pony's energy. She got flashes of images and realized the horse was nearby and nervous, but otherwise okay. I, I felt that, you know, a little bit distraught, that would be it, but not panicked. And I, she's been really a good sport about the whole thing I hear. Rankett kept focusing on the images until one jumped out. The most important sense I got was a sound of rushing water. I Search teams took the clue and followed a creek down and found the pony. They realized Gemma had walked down a ledge and gotten trapped where she couldn't turn around. Search teams ended up slipping a harness around the pony and then hauled her out by hand. Gemma walked the rest of the way to safety. I'm just so elated that the pony is fine, um, walking on her own, happy, and that she's back up on the pasture where she belongs. <laughs> Yeah, Jenna, Gemma is here in Redmond for tr uh, Redmond for training. She uh, is apparently a bit of a troublemaker in the few weeks that she's been here. She is safe in her stable tonight, and she's got only just a few scratches from this entire ordeal. Live here in Redmond, Joel Marino, Como4 News.